Welcome. So what I'd like to do in this video is kind of show you two different ways um, to be able to solve for the exterior angles. And the way that the first way I'm going to do is a little bit longer, but it's going to make sense, hopefully. So let's say I have a figure, and I don't know how many sides it has. Um, but I do know that one of the exterior angles, or all of the exterior angles, are going to be 60 degrees. So remember, by creating exterior angles, I can just extend each one of these. All right. And what's nice about knowing the exterior angles is you know that the exterior angle and the interior angle form a linear pair. So you can see these two angles, they all add up to 180. So to figure out the red, all I simply need to do is take 180 minus 60 degrees, and that equals 120 degrees. That means the interior angle of this regular polygon, right? because it has to be regular when we're dealing with our in, um, individual exterior interior angles, the interior angle is 120 degrees. So I know that the formula for an interior angle is the number of sides minus 2 times 180 divided by the number of sides. So I can say 120 degrees equals n minus 2 times 180 degrees divided by n. Now, what they're asking us, though, is to find the sum. And to find the sum, I need to know the number of sides. So I got to solve for n. So to do that, I'll multiply by n on both sides. And therefore, I have 120 degrees n equals applied distributive property. 180 degrees n minus 360. Now I get the n's to the same side. So I subtract. Subtract negative 60n equals negative 360. Divide by negative 60, divide by negative 60, n equals a positive 6. OK? These are all degrees. So n equals 6, right? Now all I need to do is tug 6 into n. Now is there another way, though, that's uh, maybe easier to do that? And yes, there is. We know that all the, remember, this is a regular polygon, meaning all the exterior angles are exactly the same because all the interior angles are exactly the same for a regular polygon. So if I know all the exterior angles are 60 degrees, we have to remember that the sum of all exterior angles, no matter what type of polygon you have, the sum of your exterior angles is always going to be 360 degrees. So therefore, if I know the sum of the exterior angles is 360, and I know the one exterior angle is 60, how many of them do I have? So all I simply need to do is just take 360 degrees and divide it by 60. Well, of course, that's going to give us six exterior angles, which will tell us we'll have six sides. So that is much easier, right? Just take your one exterior angle, divide it into 360. It's much quicker than finding the interior angle and using this formula. However, they both work. So now we have s equals 6 minus 2 times 180 degrees. s equals 4 times 180 degrees. S equals 720. Therefore, ladies and gentlemen, when you have a regular polygon with one exterior angle at 60 degrees, the sum of the interior angles will be 720. Thanks. Dello, dello, dello.